Helicopter blades are fascinating engineering marvels that generate lift through a process called aerodynamics. As the rotor blades spin, they create a difference in air pressure above and below the blades. This pressure difference generates lift, allowing the helicopter to rise into the sky. Now let's talk about collective pitch. This is a crucial control mechanism that adjusts the angle of all rotor blades simultaneously. When the pilot pulls up on the collective, the pitch of the blades increases, enhancing lift and allowing the helicopter to ascend. Conversely, lowering the collective decreases the pitch, reducing lift and enabling descent. Next, we have the main rotor, which is the primary source of lift. It consists of multiple blades that rotate around a central hub. Each blade is designed to be airfoil shaped, optimizing airflow and maximizing lift efficiency. The main rotor's speed and pitch are vital for maneuverability, allowing the helicopter to hover, climb, or turn smoothly. On the other hand, the tail rotor plays a different but equally important role. It counteracts the torque produced by the main rotor. As the main rotor spins, it creates a rotational force that would cause the helicopter to spin uncontrollably. The tail rotor generates thrust in the opposite direction, stabilizing the helicopter and allowing for controlled yaw movements. Understanding these components, how the blades generate lift, the function of collective pitch, and the roles of the main and tail rotors, reveals the intricate balance of forces that keep helicopters flying. Each part works in harmony, showcasing the brilliance of aerodynamics and engineering.